my beauties this is missy prissy borders here and welcome to my channel um tonight we're gonna have a tj max haul a dollar tree haul and a dollar general haul um my whole thing was to go out and get some drinks at the um dollar general but i also wanted to go to tj max because i felt like i just needed some retail therapy you know um, and then I want to go to Dollar Tree because my Dollar Tree, they don't have, like, if I get an idea in my mind that I want to do, they might not have everything to do it with at one visit, you know? So, every time I go, I just keep thinking of my little idea in my mind that I want to do, and then I just keep adding to my idea. So, and I got me some organizing things. I want to organize my closet because it is a hot mess. Um, I'm sure you don't want to see that. Well, I don't know. You might want to see it. I don't know. But anyway, we're going to start with this um, little haul right here from the TJ Maxx. They had a lot of cute stuff tonight, in, in my personal opinion, of the things that I like to get. And I did my nails. And I'm not nowhere near an, uh, a nail artist. I'm, I'm just not because, I mean, I've already lost two. But I think it's because I didn't really take my time and you know, file my nails and make them all pretty before I actually paint them. So, there's that. Oh, I just chased another rabbit right before we actually got into the haul. So, let's get started and let's jump in. Okay, so the first thing I saw was I wanted, I've been trying my best to learn how to put on falsies, lashes. Um, I don't have it down pat. Um, they're not as easy as they look appear to be not for me anyways I have trouble but I got this one because they were $3.99 I got this one because it has the glue it came with the glue in it and I thought that I might get my sister to teach me how to put these on because she is a false lash, lash, lashes girl and she knows how to do it Okay, so that was the first thing I got. The second thing I got was I love e.l.f. Um, I love their makeup products, their skincare, and their brushes. Some of their some of the brushes that I have over here in my collection are e.l.f. and I absolutely love them. So this was a travel kit, but it was $5.99 um, for these little four brushes. However, if I travel, I travel, but I just got them to use because they're e.l.f. and I like e.l.f. So, these were, like I said, $5.99. The next thing I got in my little bucket was, I hadn't opened this. Um, it was Bold Bronze Major Mascara from Marc Jacobs. This was $10.99. But I still wanted to try it because they've had the bronzer there before. Um, and I don't know. I just never, I mean, sometimes I have to tell myself no, but today I did not tell myself no. So, and these are a mini. So, we got the mascara. Let's just, excuse me, take it out and look at it. Nice. We'll have to play in this very, very soon. And then, what I really wanted to try out of this, though, was the, um, Excuse me, I can burp and I drink me a lemon sour. Y'all ever had a lemon sour? They are so good. If you don't know what a lemon sour is, let me tell you what a lemon sour is. Club soda, lemons, and or limes. Um, my daddy, a lot of people put salt in it. Like You squeeze the juice and mix it all up. And you can put salt with it, but I don't because I feel like I don't need the extra salt just to bloat me up. But if I drink it like that with no salt, it helps me. It flushes me out, which I love it. And I love the taste. It's so good. Like when you have had all the water you can stand, you know, it's just good. So here's the bronze. We'll have to play with this. But there's the bronze right, well, right there. You probably can't see it very good, but it is there. So this is the color it came out to be. So I'm excited about trying that. Um, I don't know if you guys have ever tried, this was Essence, it might have been put out last year, I don't know, because, um, it's got little snowflakes on the package, it was $4.99 for one, two, three, four, five, for five different, 
um, glasses. And get that open. Hold on a minute. I'm going to open this bad baby up. As I mentioned before, I got a chosen sister and a sister, so, you know, I think that they'll probably get a lip gloss. Ooh, Lord, how mercy. They are a mess. I think one of them's cracked. Doggone it. But that's okay. We can clean them right up. I love the clear. The clear is, like, the bomb, and it smells like great Kool-Aid. And look at that applicator. Awesome. You can just wear this when you don't want nothing on your lips. But I'm definitely going to have to clean it because one of them leaked out in the bag. Let me wipe my hands off because I can't stand that. Whew. Did not know that that was happening. But that's alright. Put that over there. I like this color too. I don't know what color this is. It does not have the shades. Let's see if it does. Hold on. I do have on my glasses tonight for this such thing. But I don't see a shade on here. So, woo, this is some brown, baby. So, we'll put it right there. That's the brown. This one's a uh, kind of a pinky mauve color. We'll swatch this one too. Oh yes, that's a beautiful color. Let's put it on too. That's pretty. I mean, obviously, I already had on a little gloss, but still. not notice the crack one. I'll just put it in trash. This is a probably like a little bit of a hotter pink than the last one. Or maybe it's maybe it's more sheer, I don't know. Oh yeah, this one's a lot more sheer than the last one. But it's still it's pretty. Very pretty. I'm a gloss girl. I just I really like lip gloss. I love lipstick too, don't get me wrong, but I do love my gloss as well. Let's put this in here. That was nasty. I don't like to be sticky or dirty for that matter. I mean, I don't want to get dirty. Like mud, that kind of stuff, that is so not me. I'm a girly girl. Okay. So, back at it here. Um, now, I realize this stuff comes from TJ Maxx, but you can get Essence at the drugstore. It's very affordable. Um, I'm sure you can get Marc Jacobs wherever it's sold. And I believe that you can still buy the Beauty Blender. Um, I realize when things come from TJ Maxx, not all TJ Maxx's are all created equal. I don't know if this color is for me. I just picked one that I thought that I might could use. And for a long time, I've really wanted to try this foundation. It says it's full coverage, velveteen finish, moisture boosting hyaluronic acid, antioxidants, rich while white birch extract. So, we're going to try this very soon. And if, it, if it's too light, then I'll just add a color that, you know, that matches a little bit of something darker. I could tell that this was squeezed out, but I wanted to buy it anyway. It ain't like they could stick their finger in there and contaminate it or whatever, you know. Um, but it looked like a good color, so we're going to see. It's called Bounce, and its number is shade um, 3. Point one zero. If it works, it works. If it don't, it don't. Um, I can donate it to someone if it don't work. But I've been interested in trying this one for a while. But, you know, when I go sometimes, either uh, sometimes I might not be in the mood for that a certain thing or, or whatever. You know, it's just, 
just whatever. Another thing I got was I've been wanting to try this as a deep repair mask. Um, revitalizing hair, reconstruction for dry, damaged hair. But I wouldn't say that it, mine is dry and damaged. I mean, my hair is actually in pretty good condition right now. But I still wanted to try it because, you know, a little extra don't hurt. This was on the clearance rack for ten dollars. Ten dollar. Um, as far as I know, I don't really know where you buy this at, but I know you can still get it. And it smells so good. It smells like. <sighs> fruity, something fruity. Oh, it smells good. I've never used this before, but I am looking forward to using it. So if you've used it, leave me a comment below and let me know if you like it. Oops. Okay, next thing I got was for many, many years, I used, like for 22 years, I had some baby clippers. My son is 22. I had some baby clippers, and I saved them. It went through two kids and me. I mean, they really, I really liked them because I could clean out the gunk around my fingernails. You know what's shooting your bird, but by the way. And, um, well, they broke the other day. So, I felt like I needed some more, um, no clippers. So, I got these. These were $3.99. I got them because of the small ones in there. But, I really wish I could find another pair of baby clippers that don't have, like, a, um, well, I just wish I had another pair of safety first scissors for little people, for babies, because those, those were the best scissors, not scissors, those were the best nail clippers, and you know they were good if they lasted 22 years, and I'm not joking, that is no joke. So, anyways, I got these, Precision Beauty. Um, I got these right here for the kitchen because we have some, and they're long. And I just, sometimes I just need something shorter. Like when I'm, the other day I was cooking me a, a <coughs> it was a, a keto, well, it was a keto recipe. And I was frying my little, um, pieces in the skillet and I really needed some tongs besides the ginormous ones that we do have so I went ahead and I picked up these and they were $4.99 also I got this Buxom full on lip polish and it's called Jill and it's refreshing tingling sensation Shimmering, pout, plumping, shine. That's what it says. It was $6.99. So let's say it's kind of the color of the other stuff that I got. But it's kind of like a really, it's actually a brighter pink. So I don't need to say that. Let's see. It's, ooh, yes. This is more of a hot pink right there. That's pretty. You know I'm going to put some on over all this other gloss I got on. I'm fixing to get crafty, y'all. Ooh, yes, I can feel the tingle. Well, that's what I think I want to do. There, clean my room. And it needs to be clean. Mmm, it smells good. It smells like vanilla and spicy candy. That's what it smells good. It smells very good. I love that. I'm sure it'll look good without all this other gloss. And then, I have really been trying to, these were $4.99 a piece. And they're plastic. They don't seem to be like the other kind of plastic where, I did have these separated. They were $4.99, medium fridge bin. You don't have to put them in the fridge, so I'm going to put them in the closet. Um, I've been trying to work on our closet, our kitchen pantry thing for a while but I can't seem to I mean I just I got a plan it's just not coming through yet you know um, but I do have a plan it's, it's gonna work out but it hasn't worked out yet but it will I think 
think eventually it will work out. So I got that was my TJ Maxx haul. Next we're gonna go in with the Dollar General because I know it's the sack I picked up. Okay, so I picked up these. They are keto friendly. It's basically just fried Parmesan cheese or fried cheese. So I picked these up. They're really good. In my personal opinion. I'm a reader. I like to read. Here lately, I have just want to read a book after book after book. And I don't know why. Because I took a break for a long time, I feel like. But now, when I start reading, I'm like, okay, let's read some more. So this is called On the Plus Side. And it says, it's a fresh, fun, adorable. Fresh, fun, and adorable by Allison Bliss. This was $3 at Art General. And I've, um, I've read some books before. I mean, I've picked up some paperbacks from Dollar Journal before. And I happen to like them. They're, you know, what I've had before is pretty good. And then, I've got, let's see. I'm all about makeup, guys. So, I've seen this purple eyeliner from L.A. Girl. It's neon gel, it says. I don't know. The purple, it just caught my eye in the store. And I thought, well... You know, we can try when we're doing one of those makeup looks that's out there, you know. I have a puzzle. And one time I had a puzzle that was kind of like this. This is a thousand piece puzzle. <coughs> I don't know how much it was. About five dollars maybe. Five or six. I don't know. But I got a puzzle for Christmas. But the only thing is, all the colors are kind of almost the same. I mean, not really the same. But I can feel like when I sat down to try to work on a little bit I thought this is gonna be hard so I just thought well we're gonna get something else and then we're gonna try something else and I keep hoping that Nanny will try it with me you know we'll have to wait and say also in that pack was this LA girl Jillac like shine number well I don't have a number on it but I got that nail polish right there I thought that was a pretty hot pink but this one is the one that caught my eye. Can't believe they don't have a number on it. Usually they have a number. Oh well. Let's see. They don't say the color, I don't think. Oh wait. This one is called Jazzy. So I'm really interested in paint my nails that color. Let's see if the pink one has a name. Yep, the pink one is flashy. So they did have a name. So I got those. That is, well, I can't say that's all from, but that's basically all the fun stuff from Dollar General because I had to get drinks and you know what a diet coat and a coat looks like, so we're not going there. But they did have them on sale for 3 for 10, which a better deal, I think, is 4 for 10, but that's at Kroger sometimes. Okay, so we can get to the Dollar Tree. I have, obviously, I got a diet coat while I was out. Um... Okay, so I have all this craft stuff, and I have a picture in my mind about how I want to organize my things in my closet because I got my craft stuff in there, I got my toilet paper in there, I got my clothes in there, and I really am thinking ahead, sort of, as to how I want to organize my stuff, but I got to get me a shelf. So, but anyways, why is it Dollar Tree? I got these cute little containers because they can sit on the side like this. Or like this but I got these because to put the little tiny thing in like I don't know these or whatever you know they can have some stuff in there I got two of these I think or three I have to look and see and I also got this star right here and it has a plastic lid so I got these I don't I only got one of this kind and maybe I can't remember if it was two or three of this kind. I have a vision in mind. I just, I gotta make it come together. Sometimes that takes a bit, you know? Okay, that's two more of those uh, jars I told you about. <laughs> I've got this. It's a pencil box, yes, but I'm going to use it to put the small things in, like some rocks or beads or whatever. I have 
have an idea of something I want to make. Now, I'm going to have to figure out how to do it. I saw this. I got this because I might have to use this. I also got this right here. Um, of course, they're great to paint on. Of course, that's what they're for. But if you want to take it apart and take the take this off, you can use this wood around it because I, I hear it's awesome. But I have an idea. So, I'm going to show it to you. I don't know how I'm going to make the backing. I don't know if it's going to fit right here. I kind of wanted a frame, like a real frame. But at the Dollar Tree today, they didn't have what the biggest one I wanted. So, what I want to do, I've seen this kind of, I don't know if y'all have ever watched, um, I don't know if her name is LG Queen or something, but it's a glam. I like glam. And in my bathroom, I'm going to do a little bit more glam than in here, you know. Well, anyway, so they had mirrors today. They didn't have any the other day. Look, you can see all my mask right there. All my makeup, because I did tell you I had a lot of stuff. Okay, so anyways, um, I got four of these. Um, I'm going to put them side by side somehow. And then... And make sure they're on the back end of whatever I choose to put them on. I wanted a picture frame so I could put them inside. But anyways, regardless of that, this um, that YouTube channel I watched where they made glam stuff, like glam um, decor. Um, they painted the mirrors. It was so cool. And I thought, I can do that, you know. Because um, I love to paint anyway. So I like to get crafty. Um... And I got this beautiful picture hanging up here above my desk that my cousin gave me. And it's so pretty. And when I was watching that channel, it reminded me of this. Only this is on a canvas, which I can still do it on a canvas. But I kind of wanted to do it on the mirror. I don't know. It's just really cool. So if you, if you like glam stuff, um, look up. Um, just search glam decor glam diy on youtube and i'm sure you'll find it it's called queen something or lg queen or it's something i can't remember what her name is but oops i really do like to watch that so i got a couple of ideas of how i might get to put that together and i don't know if i've already told y'all or not in any haul that i've had before if um that i want to make a um, I want to make, I got a wreath for them too. I, I think I left it in the car because I got one in here. Um, but I really want to make a 4th of July wreath. I don't know how yet. I, I mean, it's kind of coming together in my mind a little bit. But I got this right here. This kind of like, you know, stuff that you would use on a Christmas tree if it was a different color. So, I got two of them. I mean, I got an idea. You know, it's, just, it's got to come together. It's just got to come together. Okay. So, last time, I bought some of these that I had been searching for and searching for. Well, so now I went back and I didn't have but like two or three packs. So, I think they had three and I got two. Or maybe they just had two. I don't know. I don't remember. And um, I got me some glue sticks for my glue gun. This is better to buy a 20 pieces for a dollar. I feel like, I mean, it's cheap or affordable, if you will. Um, I've used these before in my closet to make little, um, on one row that I've got stuff. I've, they're all in the basket and they're all labeled and I love it. So I use these and I thought, well, you know, I might need that. Um, I had ordered these from Amazon, but since I can't find them, because I got craft stuff absolutely everywhere, I got me another pack of these. Um, I got this little tool right here because I feel like it would come in handy at some point. So, it's got a little sharp end, and then it's got a little flat end that you can just, I don't know, I just felt like it would come in handy. Um... This ribbon right here struck me as so pretty, so I got some of that. Um, I got this um, glittery paint ribbon. I have an idea for that because I am going to 
my little, my friend, you know, she had a baby. And I'm sure I've mentioned this before. I've got a letter that I'm going to paint. I got stuff piled up around, well, not piled up, but, you know, kind of. Um, I just want to get organized so I can see what I got and, and do what I got. But mostly, everything's makeup over here, which is, I absolutely love makeup. And I'm trying to grow my channel over YouTube and trying to, uh, different things because I want to grow my channel. I want to be an awesome YouTuber. Anyway, so we got this felt piece. I thought I would get these in red, white, and blue, but they only had one red, so I got it anyways. Um, and then, I'm a candle girl. I don't know if I've not mentioned that before, but these little candles are so cute. This one is wood sage and sea salt. I mean, you want to smell of it? But it's so cute. Just to burn it. It's just like a little wooden wick. And surprisingly, they smell very good. I got the best too. So, what I say? Wood sage and sea salt. Scented candle. Smells divine. And you, when it's burned up, you can use this little container for something else. Or you put some nice wax melts in it or something. And this one is... Um, Pro, Prosco, and Rose. Now, I don't know what that first part is. I'll show it to you. So, I butchered that. But it smells like kind of vanilla. It, to me, it smells like vanilla and roses. Maybe not so much rose, but vanilla for sure. But it smells so good. It's so very good. It's really cute. They kind of look like they're, they might be a, like a, a boho look if you got that which I don't have that but still I bought them because they smell good and I love candles I'm a candle girl so that is pretty much all for my haul and I thank y'all so much for watching me tonight um I hope you enjoyed this um I hope you somebody's calling me I hope you enjoy this haul um it was fun for me I needed to get out sometimes if I stay home too long it'll get to where I'm thinking okay do I really want to go um anxiety will set in you know so and I don't want that to happen so that's why I had to get out today and do me a little bit of um you know retail therapy retail therapy is the best for someone actually it's best for me um, so anyways, thank y'all so much for watching. If you like this kind of content, please subscribe and share me with your friends. Share my channel with your friends. Um, please like, subscribe, and share. And I will be back before you know it. Remember that you are beautiful and God don't make no junk. So you're awesome the way you are. Thank y'all so much. Bye.